Good evening and thanks for sticking with us for your news at 1030. I'm Cynthia Beasley. We now know the name of the teen who died after a chase with police in Sumter County. The coroner identified him as 17 year old Raven Harris, a student at Sumter High School. WIS reporter Jalen Tart has more on what led to the chase. A disturbance called an altercation over a social media post in downtown Sumter went left for two teens, which ended in a car crash that ended the life of Raymond Harris. Well, social media, of course, is a good tool, and, and it could be a negative tool. The incident started around 5.30 Friday night, where the Sumter Police Department responded to an altercation and fight at Red Lobster on Broad Street. But, you know, Broad Street is a, is a considerably uh, crowded travel, uh, very highly traveled air, uh, highway. And um, certainly and that's, that's a situation where a chase could possibly be called off. We are told the fight began when an unnamed 16 year old punched an employee and pulled out a gun. Police say that the 16 year old left the scene in a car with Harris. The vehicle was later spotted by an officer who tried to initiate a traffic stop at Manning Road. Police say that's when the 16 year old jumped out of the car and ran away. Investigators say Harris sped away and led officers on a high speed chase, hitting speeds of up to 100 miles per hour. Police say Harris lost control and crashed on Mulberry Church Road. The teen was airlifted to Prison Health Richland, where he later died due to his injuries on Sunday. As others could have been harmed or injured in this altercation of other people on the highway during the time. So again, we just ask that you, you please pull over if you're summoned to stop by law enforcement and um, obey the commands of the, of the officer. The South Carolina Highway Patrol and the Sumter County Coroner's Office are currently investigating this crash. Harris's autopsy is scheduled for tomorrow at the Medical University of South Carolina in Charleston. Reporting at Sumter, Jalen Tart, WIS News 10.